there's the setup here. That kind of looks kind of nasty, you know, nothing that deepens. But it was, you know, it's sort of the short wave from L. So I know there's all talk about, you know, stratfold, uh, uh, potential vorticity coming down to the surface. Yeah, but what was the signal on this of all storms? Why did this one decide to do it on this, this particular instance? I don't think I've really seen anything so, yeah, well, much like this. So, yeah, what was the indication? There was one guy on the board, actually, that did forecast it pretty well. He's yeah, not, he does not here today, but he forecast almost exactly what would happen. Really? What did he see? Well, I would say that the Vortmax, it's, you know, just from ge general, mm -hmm. the Vortmax was really concentrated. Yes, that sir. that may be a signature. Really strong, too. Yeah. But, but still, to have a response like that, you know, I'm, you know, yeah, I could see it deepening rapidly, but not at those kind of, to me, it was like an anomaly. Yeah, yeah. Like, what's, yeah, well, what, what, you know, I, I'd like to see what some of the science is saying, but. There's, there's no high, look at the winds, the winds are howling out of the No, it's had it's nothing to do with a big high. It was yeah. all generated all by this development over four hours. Four yeah. hours. That's bizarre, crazy. <laughs> so I like stuff like that. Yeah, it is. And then there's February 11th and 12th. Um, so, um, you know, I don't think I have to say that much. This is actually the last time I was on the air. So I think that was actually a good send off. <clears throat> you know, not a very impressive setup from a synoptic perspective. You know, it's got a little bit of a surface eye up to the north, and not a very impressive surface eye. Here's the evening where things started to come together. Actually, remember when I was forecasting, this was a system like, when is it going to happen? And it turns out from some observations, it was already really starting to happen in the northwest suburbs of DC. And that spread pretty fast in the northeast. So this, this is the time where things were really going crazy here with the big band. And then it was over. Need, needless to say, this will be in the next book, you think? So that's, you know, I can just sort of uh, go quick, quickly through this. The upper level maps, there's the NISA scale, snowfall distribution. <laughs> 2006, 2007 came down to these two storms. Yeah, I think I'm just going to. 2007, 2008, a lot of storms in December in New England, otherwise. <laughs> And Dave was going to talk about it. I think it's getting late. Uh, there's there's the snowfall distribution for the March 1 and 2. It was uh, Nisus category 1 because it was primarily, it was a large area, not a huge area, but large area 4 to 10. Yeah. <clears throat> That's what I do now. <laughs> Here. Um, I, I know it's gone really late because I could be a hacker. So if, uh, you know we can we don't have to do questions now, but anybody that wants to come up and talk to me and buy my milk um, <laughs> can, can do so uh, at any time this evening. Thank you. <laughs>